wajabu wewe wajabu wajabu wewe waja everyone lift up your hands Lift up your hands, everyone, in the presence of the Lord. Worship him. Worship him in truth and in spirit. In the name of Jesus. For this new beginning, oh Father, we worship you and we declare there is none like you today. In the mighty name of Jesus, we worship and pray. Can someone rejoice? Amen. Celebrate, Celebrate Jesus. Jesus in this place. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Remember, what God cannot do does not exist. It is your time to walk in the favor of God. Praise the name of the living God. Amen. And that is why David knew the secret of walking with God. Praise the name of the living God. Amen. Putting your trust in God, you will never be ashamed. Gina Labona Lipewe Sifa. Today is the day that the Lord has made. Amen. Viewers all over the world, God loves you. He is there wherever you are. You might be watching us, but distance is not a barrier. He is touching your life in the name of Jesus. Amen. And everything that will not move, just know from now, you will start walking in different dimensions to the glory of God. Praise the name of the living God. Amen. Let us celebrate our choir as they sit down in Jesus' name. Hallelujah. In the book of Psalms 92, 12 verse 14. I hope so you have your Bibles. Can I see your Bible? Can I see your Bible? Can I see your Bible? Some of you, are, you're, you're showing me your phones. Ha. Ah. In the book of Psalms 92, 12 to 14. Are we together? The word of God says, 
the righteous will flourish like a palm tree they will grow like a cedar of lebanon planted in the house of the lord they will flourish in the courts of our god can someone say i receive they will flourish in the courts of the lord that means when you leave when you worship him in truth and in spirit you will lack nothing good praise the name of the living god because you will flourish you will walk according you will walk according to his promises praise the name of the living god walking in his promises means there is nothing you shall lack walking in his promises means you shall partake of his blessings today i know you shall not know dryness in the name of jesus in your life in the name of jesus because it is your time to flourish because you live in the house of the lord you worship him in truth and in spirit and that is why hannah in the book of, in the in the in the book of hannah the word of god says hannah did not know dryness because she walked with the lord no matter the challenges she could persist in prayer and walk in victory walking in victory year 2024 it is for those who are walking by faith walking by faith not by sight the world in the world the people walk by sight but in the kingdom of god we must walk by faith Praise the name of the living God. Walking by faith is receiving what the Lord has in store for you. I see people not knowing dryness in year 2024. Because the Lord has great and mighty things in your life. The year 2023, we have been trusting God. We have been praying like never before. But this year, the Lord says, is your year to rest. The year of rest, praise the Lord. The year of rest is the year of not knowing dryness is the year of those who walk by faith flourishing like a palm tree in the house of the lord is for those who run is for those who go in different dimension and fly you will walk you will run you will you will fly high and you will go in the space because it is by the spirit of god to those who are in the spirit and walk by faith and that is why we find this man in the Bible who was called Hannah. This, this woman who was called Hannah. She did not waver in her faith. But she stood in faith in prayer. You cannot be in prayer and you do not have faith. It can never happen. But when you are in prayer, you must be a woman and a man of faith. Praise the name of the living God. This is your year in the name of Jesus. To those who are walking by faith, you will overpower you will overcome in the name of Jesus because there is nothing that God cannot do in this year of 2024 your limitations are over because the Lord is saying it is your year of, of, of rest in the name of Jesus I remember there was a doctor who gave me a story one day and this doctor told me there was an accident and people were brought in and most of them died and they realize when they are checking these bodies one of the phones in a man's pocket started ringing when they took the phone it was an alarm that is when he realized the alarm could wake him when he's sleeping but when he was dead the alarm could not wake him praise the lord what does that mean the things of the world can never help us in our time of need in our desperate situations 
that when we are in Christ Jesus, we will always be alert. Praise the Lord. To those who live in prayer, they must be alert in the spirit. Praise the name of the living God. You must be prayerful and alert in the spirit for you to walk in the light of the living God. This is your year in the name of Jesus. The year of rest is for those who pray and worshiping in truth and in spirit. And to those who are alert in the spirit will detect what the Lord is saying. Will know what the Lord is saying in their lives. Because you will always be in the light of the Lord. Utakuwa kwa mwangaza katika jina la Yesu. Hautakuwa kwa giza. Maana Bwana anasema, mwaka huu ni mwaka wa kupumzishwa. Mwaka huu ni mwaka wa kuinuliwa. Jina la Bwana lipewe sifa. It is not our time to mama. It is not our time to fail, but it is our time to look unto him. The word of God says, I will look unto the mountains. Where will my help come from? My help will come from the Lord. The creator of heaven and earth. It is your season, child of God. Do not fail in your faith, but walk according to his promises. Walking in his promises is walking in looking to the vision and the dreams you have. The dreams and the visions you have. You walk in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Before you reach the end, you will start saying, it is for the Lord's goodness. It is for the Lord's will. It is for the Lord's purpose. I am here today. Praise the Lord. In the book of Luke 5 verse 4, Supernatural manifestations must follow those who are walking by faith and walking in truth and in spirit. Supernatural manifestations. In the book of Luke 5, are we there? In the book of Luke 5, verse 4, when he had finished speaking, he said to Simon, put out into the deep water and let down the nest for a catch. Verse 5, Simon answered, Master, we have worked hard all night and haven't caught anything. But because you say so, I will let down the nest. Verse 6, when they had done so, they caught such a large number of fish that their nets began to sink. The year 2025 is for those who will walk in supernatural manifestations. Praise the name of the living God. Walking in supernatural manifestations. It is the year of rest. Because these men had walked all through night and by daytime Jesus appeared to them and broke the protocol of the fishermen. I do believe fish, fishermen do fish at night because they do believe at night they can catch such a large number of fish but Jesus was here telling them during the day night send back your nest to the to the waters for you to catch a, 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 a large number of fish this was a miracle in this year of 2024 miracles will happen to those who walk by faith in the name of Jesus miracle will happen supernatural manifestations will start being depicted in your life in the name of Jesus I declare over your life May you be lifted. May you be lifted in the name of Jesus. This is a family. They do believe is there is generational curses. There is diseases. But I'm here to announce over your life. You are no longer cursed in the name of Jesus. You are rising by the blood of Jesus. May supernatural manifestations happen in your life in the name of Jesus. Don't thank God for cars. Don't thank God for vehicles. Don't thank God for properties. Don't thank God for material things. But thank God for the greatness and the grace he has kept in your life. This year, it is for those people who will thank God for the grace which he has installed in their lives. 
praise the name of the living God. The grace which is installed in your life. It is the grace which will see you through. It is the grace which will help you conquer and uplift you in your time of need. Praise the name of the living God. Today I see business, businesses flourishing in the name of Jesus. I see businesses flourishing because it is your time to arise in the name of Jesus. Isaiah 60 verse 1. Arise and shine. The light has come and the glory of the Lord rises upon thee. It is your season. It is your year. Child of God. It is your year of rest. In the name of Jesus. It is your year of overcoming. In the name of Jesus. Jesus told the disciples. Put, put the nest again in the waters. To catch for these fishes. It was a miracle. They did not believe. But Simon said. Because you have said so. I will do so. Because you have said so. I will do so. May you walk in the light. In the name of Jesus. May you walk in the word. In the name of Jesus. Because you are more than a conqueror. You will enjoy God's favor because rest must go forth with the supernatural manifestations of the grace of God. Hallelujah. Of the grace of God, of the favor, of restoration. You must be restored. Where there is rest, restoration is depicted. Hallelujah. Restoration is depicted. If you lost your house, if you lost your family, this is your year in the name of Jesus. Of restoration of this family. Restorations of backgrounds. Restorations of businesses. In the name of Jesus, it is your time to enjoy the blessings of the Lord. Can someone lift up your hands? It is your time and your season in the name of Jesus. It is your time and your season in the name of Jesus. This year, you shall not know dryness you shall walk in the blessings of the living God in the name of Jesus you should not worry you should not fear says the Lord I will put you among those I have believed because you are my child in the name of Jesus can you begin to thank the Lord for year 2024 thank the Lord for year 24 thank the Lord for year 24 it is your year it is your time it is your year in the name of Jesus viewers all over the world it is your year of rest. Begin to thank the Lord. Begin to walk, to walk in the favor. Begin to walk in the manifestations of breakthrough. In the name of Jesus. Year 2024. You shall not know dryness in the name of Jesus. Tell your neighbor, welcome to Broad Highway. Of rest in the name of Jesus. Of rest in the name of Jesus. Rest. Walking in high places. Kutembea. Pahala paju. Jina la buona lipewe sifa. Kutembea kwa pahala paju. Kutembea kwa ufunuo mpya. Kutembea kwa ufunuo mpya. Walking in the in the in the revelation. New revelation. New grace will start working in your life like never before because you will be walking in truth and in spirit. Praise the name of the living God. I can't hear your amen because your time has come. I can't hear your amen. Your rest has come. Your season to rest has come. Your season to enjoy the blessings of God has come. Year 2024. Walk in greatness in the name of Jesus. Walk in the good health in the name of Jesus. Many people have been trusting God for a wife, for, for, for a husband. It is your time to receive your soulmate in the name of Jesus. You have been trying in business. It is your time to be uplifted in the name of Jesus because the rest will come with restoration. Rest will come with the favor. Rest will come with new grace of taking new places in the name of Jesus. Those who look down to you, they will look up to you because you will be a woman of favor. A woman who is carrying a new grace in the name of Jesus. If you, if you are here under my voice, begin to thank God. Begin to glorify his name because I can't hear you. Because I can't wait to hear your testimony in the name of Jesus. 
I can't wait to hear your testimony. There are people here who have been trusting God for businesses. They have been trusting God for the families to be united. The season for you is now. Year 2024, you will rest and enjoy and rejoice the goodness of the Lord in Jesus' name. In the book of Deuteronomy 2 verse 3, the children of Israel went around the mountains for years. But a time came the Lord said, this is not the way. I will show you the way. It was for 40 years. You have been toiling. You have been praying. This is a year to receive your answer prayers. In the name of Jesus. This is a year to receive your answer prayers. For receiving direction. In the name of Jesus. Oh, praise the name of the living God. For two minutes, thank the Lord. Lift up your hands. Begin to thank the Lord. Thank the Lord. Is no by power. Is no by mind. Is by my spirit. Says uh, yeah. Is no by power. Is no Every yoke, the word of God says on the last day, shall be broken from their yoke, from their necks. The yokes shall be broken. The mountains shall be removed. You may take your seats. Because it is the Lord's doing. When God says yes, no one can say no. When God, does, when God does it, everyone around you will know there is a new thing that has happened inside your life. Praise the name of the living God. Everyone will know that the Lord has favored you because you are coming out of this situation victoriously in the name of Jesus. Praise the name of the living God. You are coming out of this situation victoriously in the name of Jesus. I declare you are coming out of this situation victoriously in the name of Jesus. You shall not lose your own, but you shall rejoice, says the Lord. We find this man called Joseph. Joseph went through a law. Joseph did not look down to himself, but he looked to the promise keeper because he knew his strength and his will and the will that God had purposed for him. It was for greatness. Praise the name of the living God. This year it is not an year to look down to yourself, to look on what you are going through, to look on what people are saying, but it is a year to look on what the Father is speaking in your life, to look on what Jesus has spoken in your life. Praise the name of the living God. The word of God says, 
his promises are yes and amen it is your time to put your trust in the promises of the Lord kutembea kwa majira kutembea kwa majira ya Bwana inataka watu ambao ni wavumilivu inataka ambao watu wanatembea kwa imani Praise the Lord. Watu ambao wanatembea kwa imani ni watu ambao wanainuliwa, ni watu ambao wanasonga mbele, ni watu ambao wanapokea vipawa, baraka katika jina la Yesu. Maana shetani mbinu yake ni ya kukufanya kujiangalia, kuangalia kile ambacho unapitia, to look at your challenges. But when you look on to the promises of God, rejoice in your heart you will receive and you will find rest in the name of Jesus I declare over your life may you receive rest in this year in Jesus name may you receive rest in the name of Jesus in the year 2024 in your business receive rest in your career receive rest in your finances receive rest in the name of Jesus no matter the limitations no matter Kenya the way we are it does not matter the way we are the way the economy is it does not matter all I know what God cannot do does not exist it is your ear to walk in the favor it is your ear to overpower principalities and the rulers in the name of Jesus the Lord has showed me and I cry. Many people have cried. Mumelia. What when you amelia? Kwa maombi. What amelia? In challenges, people have cried. But I see the Lord's hand wiping the tears in people's eyes. Because the rest will come with restoration. The rest will come with joy. The rest will come with the favor and the manifestations. The manifestations of God's blessings upon your life. Jina la buwana lipewe sifa. Supernatural manifestations must be seen to those who will rest in the word of God. Praise the name of the living God. people of God the fuel price is coming down in the name of Jesus fuel price is coming down because when the Lord is bringing rest things will start favoring you even the things which you do not which you do not, which, 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 which in your life that does not make sense, you will start seeing they are making sense in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Nikisema fuel price, may you walk and purchase your car in the name of Jesus. Wanze kupokea garielako katika jina la yeso. Receive your vehicles in the name of Jesus. When he adjusts fuel price, may you receive in the name of Jesus your vehicle. Tembea kwa gari lako katika jina la Yesu. Tembea kwa njia za juu katika jina la Yesu. Maana wakati wako umefika, o oh, wakupumzishwa katika jina la Yesu. Mwaka huu ni mwaka wakupumzishwa. When I say rest, when Jesus says rest, it is rest because everything within you about you will be a rest and rejoicing in the name of Jesus father we thank you 